everybody. Welcome back to another awesome day, another awesome vlog. St. Patrick's Day is over. My trees, are, of course, are still decorated for St. Patrick's Day. I haven't quite taken those down yet. But as you can see in this front room, we have redecorated. This used to be our dining room, and we actually moved some furniture around, had this more of a sitting room with my trees in the back, but we've changed it back to a dining room. I am going to start decorating my dining room table for Easter and spring, and I'm going to make a really cute centerpiece, and I wanted to show you. And then shortly after that, um, in another video, I will decorate my trees to coordinate with my table for Easter. But for now, let's get started on the centerpiece and decorating the table. Let's go. For my table, I actually got a lot of things, again, at the Dollar Tree this year. They have so many great things. If you just keep checking back, you really can find things there that you might not expect to find. For example, I found these really pretty placemats. They were only a dollar each, so they have these beautiful spring flowers and butterflies on this side and a solid teal color on the back. So realistically, you could use these for two different table settings and two different styles. I also found these beautiful matching napkins that I'm going to use these uh, napkin rings that I already owned that are gold to match these beautiful chargers that are um, gold as well and they have these pretty little beads around the edge. I found these at the Dollar Tree as well. Every once in a while you can just find some really great things that ordinarily would be a lot more expensive. So I was very happy with the things that I found. So I'm gonna go ahead and start putting down some of my settings and then I'll start showing you how I'm going to make my centerpiece. For my centerpiece, I'm actually going to be using this three-tiered plate stand and some small off-white bowls that I'm going to fill with some Easter items. I have purchased some moss, some colorful eggs, and some carrots. I also have some cute little ducks that I'm going to be adding in. So next I'm gonna take these flowers, they are called dogwood. I got them from the Dollar Tree as well. I'm gonna clip some pieces off that I can twist around my centerpiece and um, just have a pretty little floral um, addition. And because it's wired, <clears throat> it will attach easily, but then you can also form it around the I'm now gonna add my plates. These are what I'm gonna use, just a very simple plate to 
to go on top of the chargers and under the napkins. And then I have a few other little things that I'm going to start adding onto my table. And then I will show you the finished product. Okay, so here is my final table viewing. I love these little carrots. I just used glue dots, as you saw, to glue them onto the napkin ring. And the thing that I love about glue dots are they are easy to remove so I can use the napkin ring again in the future after removing the carrot. I have added some of my own decor to the table and by using the things that I already own and a few things from the Dollar Tree, I was able to put together a beautiful spring and Easter table at very little cost. It was very, very inexpensive. I'm also really happy about my centerpiece. I think it turned out really cute. I did something similar with this three-tiered uh, plate stand at Christmas time and I did a Christmas village stacked in here and it turned out really cute as well. All right, everybody, I hope you enjoyed my video. I hope you enjoyed watching me create a centerpiece. I hope that that has got your creative juices flowing and will give you some ideas of things that you can do for your Easter and spring table. I wanted to get this done early so that if you were interested in any of the items that I purchased at the Dollar Tree, you could get there soon enough before they run out. I also wanted to do it soon enough to get you guys thinking about what you're gonna do for your own table because spring is right around the corner and Easter is going to be here soon as well. So I obviously wanna have my table set in advance so that it will look pretty while we are leading up to Easter and while we are heading into spring. I hope you enjoyed my video. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe. Bye!